Yeah, it's better, Anubha. Sometimes the network is very dodgy across the places. So if you're oh. missing, we can always refer to that. Yeah, yeah. Actually, I have put some things on YouTube also, I said, but it's fine. Uh, huh. So uh, we are, uh, I mean, pyfm.sh, we are generating. We are generating the Genesis block. We are generating the organization. We are generating the channels. We are generating the membership service providers. Okay. Once we have done it, we have to reverse engineer this. How did we do it? Okay, so for this, we are going into config transaction dot yml. Okay, because over here, all the files are referring to crypto config dot yml and config transaction dot yml. Okay, so we can see both the files. Okay. You can see here orderers are given. Okay, all the orderer organizations what are the host names. Okay. After that, all the peer organizations what will be the names? They are also given. Okay. How many organizations will be there? Organization one and organization two. Okay. And what will be the domains? Domains are organization two dot example dot com. We are filling node on this. And we are making uh, users number one. Users number of users to be accessible as one. Okay. Once we have done it, we are going to see a config transaction dot yml also. Okay. Uh, we have policies. We have um, in policies there are enforcement policies given which are readers, writers, administrators. Okay. Uh, we have different organizations and directors. Okay. Uh, again, in the organizations, we are writing policies. Okay. After that, the most important uh, section is capabilities. Okay. What is every organization capable? You can make your own policies over here. Okay. So, what are readers? What are uh, I mean? What are applications? I mean, and the thing uh, thing is, if I am making any policy, there are rules defined. Okay. Based upon this file. Once I have defined my rules, once I have defined my policies, let's make the network again up. We have defined channels, we have defined policies, we have defined profiles. Okay. In profiles, always remember you have to give details about the entire consortium. Okay. How many uh, I mean organizations are there? Okay, organization one or how many channels are there? If it's a consortium, then what are the capabilities? Have you mentioned capabilities? Have you mentioned, uh, I mean, who are the brokers? How will message going take place? Okay, so we'll be using Kafka for that. Okay. And we are also telling what are the different orders. Okay, so once we have, uh, I mean, made this file or we have customized this file, what we'll do is if you are able to do up or generate, okay, we we'll take this up again. Okay, and uh, I mean, before up, you can also see what are the Docker files. Doing. Okay, when you do Docker compose, CLI.ML. Okay. So in which in this process it's giving ke, how many containers it is to make. Okay. How are peers writing? How are what are volumes? Okay. Everything it is going to define along with where it will be mounted. Okay. So slash where slash run is the place where it is mounted. This is the place where it will get the chain code from. This is the crypto config file. These are the channel artifacts. Okay. Based upon this, we are going to make this network up. Okay. Okay, we are starting this. Now, uh, I mean, what we will do is you will open another. Channel.
okay so you can see one by one things are getting loaded okay now let's uh, i mean as things are getting installed you can see the code is getting over here so what we are doing is docker logs minus f and we'll give any one of the peers okay because there is that is the place where i'm building uh, my thinking place okay so we can see that there are orders there are peers okay so i'll take one of the orders and just see the logs of this container okay can you see this this chain code is getting fired channel is getting so that's how somebody was asking me about the gossip protocol yesterday okay okay we did not cover it the thing is we had to see the logs and only then we'll able to whether it is following gossip or not. okay can you see gossip is written over here new gossip provider gossip state provider gossip stream okay so these are the gossip protocol which is the so gossip is what if one peer is coming okay if one peer is coming up and uh, i mean orderer is um, of feeding the i mean the organization with the peers in protocol okay. so now there must be a lot of peers <coughs> and we are making a solution for a bank or we are making a solution for an iot based company there will be so many receivers there will be so many uh, sensors okay so there will be so many peers so in order to communicate to the peer we will be using gossip protocol gossip means one one and if a peer starts okay uh, what if the second peer is sleeping so it will continuously ping that okay so this protocol which is responsible for broadcasting among peers is known as a gossip protocol it's like gossiping okay how to gossip spread okay so is this uh, yeah tell me you know actually uh, anubhav, anubhav just a second your voice is not very very clear it's uh, i mean there is there seems to be some static some your voice is breaking basically uh, a little so it's not very clearly audible i thought it was only for me now charan is also yeah, pinned on that Is it audible now? Yeah, I think it is. Should be better. As you can start, continue. I mean, Daniel. Ah, is it better, folks? I mean, I'll be speaking for. Honestly, one minute. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, uh, and after that, you yeah, it is about it. Okay. So, uh, I mean, we have seen yeah. how we have run the Docker Compose dot YAML. We have also seen how we have run the config file. We have seen how did we run the config uh, file of uh, I config certification file. Okay, we have generated some certificates, and we have made the network up again. Okay, now in order to um i mean we reverse engineer this network okay we are just going through the logs of the uh, existing containers which are running and we are just seeing okay how is this uh, i mean working okay once we are done this we uh, will be able to make the network from scratch so the end of this class uh, the thing is our motive is to make the network from scratch okay and uh, just and uh... I think it's still bad. Uh, yeah, see some no noise. There is actually nothing. I'm sitting in a silent room. Actually, I'm so sorry to say. Uh, yeah, I but no, it's not about the background. It's basically about uh, you know the. I think is is there an issue with the bandwidth there because can you somebody can you drop in voice is getting. Yeah, yeah, sure, sure. I'll I can do that. I mean, I'll reconnect it again. Not an issue. 